I got a special treat for y'all boys today, man. Y'all. Oh, look at what it say on there, y'all. <laughs> God is great. Is it that simple? God is great. Don't get no simpler than that, bro. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy D Frank, man. Welcome back to God and Guns, bro. And today, 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 man, I'm gonna go ahead and, and blur out everything. But I got a special treat for y'all boys today, man. Y'all see the title of that video. Today I'm unboxing the Timu TRL1 Streamlight. Now, I'm gonna go ahead, cause I'm kind of pushed for time right now. That kind of been a narrative for like the past few videos. So I'm about to open it up. You know what I'm saying? Let y'all get a good, a good look at it too. I got my box cut up, but it's in the back seat and I don't feel like reaching it. So we're gonna try to open it up this way. Oh, look at what it's saying on there, y'all. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all know once I get the batteries and everything why I decided to go with a quote unquote fake TRL one. All right, y'all, as y'all can see now, I got the seal open, man. Let's see. Okay, another box. I ain't gonna lie, it got some weight. Oh, I should have. Well, like I said, I'm just trying to figure out what batteries in these. So let's see how we looking. Ooh, you know what I'm saying? It, and it comes with all of the. um. The different rail um types like a 13 no 1913 rail it comes with as you guys can see the gl which is glock rail on it let's go ahead and take it out wow bro it's heavy like a trl because i didn't held it wow i ain't gonna lie fellas to say this supposed to be a quote-unquote knockoff this is really good quality bro now i ain't gonna lie the the switches are kind of stiff like I said, I've held a few real TRLs, TLRs, excuse me. And um, yeah, man, I'm a little excited about this, bro. I gotta see what batteries it take. And once I figure out what batteries it take, I'll get back with y'all, man. All right, y'all, so we made it back to the house. Um, I went ahead and got some batteries, man. I Googled it. They said that the 123 is the same as the CR123A. So I'm hoping it fits, man. But now that I'm home, first off, I'm going to let y'all boys see that. The EDC, we rocking strong with that new EDC, man. Best EDC on the market, but we ain't, we ain't here for that. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys another sneak peek of how it look when it come in the box. It comes with a box, then it comes inside a box. You know what I'm saying? Y'all already saw most of it, but I got my better quality, you know, light and my camera and everything. So, you know what I'm saying? You guys can see it a little better. It comes with a bunch of these, like, different rail systems that you can put in there. And it should come equipped with the Glock if I was correct, but this is how it comes, man. Just like this in this box, you know what I'm saying? As you can see that GL stand for Glock. Oh man, I wanna show you guys how good it looks. It looks so, 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 so good, bro. Look at this. Look at how it looks. Man, I ain't gonna lie, bro. The quality is so, so fire, dog. Yeah, but those of you who don't know, this is from Timu, bro. Like. This is from T-Move because the one on eBay did not work. But we ain't going to waste too much more time, man. Yeah, I've seen a lot of people saying that, th that theirs was plastic. This is not plastic at all. Like, I'm trying to hit it and let you guys feel. Like, this is not plastic. This is like that good material. Like, I've held a few T um, TLRs on ones. And it's kind of got the same feel, bro. I'm not going to lie. Show you guys how to open it up on the back. You basically lift this up. And you just lift that up like that, pull it out, and open it up. Now, as you can see, it takes two batteries, man. I don't want to waste too much more time. I'm going to go ahead and get the batteries in. See you guys once I get these batteries in. Okay, y'all, so flash warning. I did go ahead and get it in, man, and the weight feels so, so good. Look at that. Stroll mode. <laughs> if you guys want to know if it's fake or not, right, y'all see? Why is my camera tripping today, dog? All right, now if you want to see if it's a fake or not, y'all see what it says. All right, there we go. Now, if you want to see if it's fake or not, y'all see how it says streamlight.com, www. For the most part, if it has that www.com, it's a fake. So I ain't trying to be that person, bro, but I just seen a few of y'all boys with them full gauges TRLs, man. 
you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna put your business out there, but I didn't see y'all boys, man. But I'm just joking, dog. God is good. Uh, it works, you know what I'm saying? You hit it that way. You hit it this way for the stroke. Like, it's just, it's fire, bro. Like, the knobs, as you can see, is not really... Sometimes it strobe, sometimes it is momentary. But yeah, man, you guys know how the TLR work. The TLR work. I'm not trying to show y'all all these different things. Y'all know what the light is, obviously, if you click on the video. Now, the gun that I'm putting it on, this is how the gun look. There it go. Why is it? I don't know. But this is how the gun look before the um, light on it. I can't put lights or nothing on the guns no more on the screen. So, yeah, I'll be right back. Loosen this up a little bit. Okay, so I have it on right now, as you guys can see. <laughs> I have it on right now, as you guys can see, man. I have it on. And I'm going to definitely let y'all know why I got the clone instead of an actual one. But, yeah, man, I got it on the gun. I don't know why my camera is tripping. I got it on the gun. This is how it looks on the gun. It looks good. I have to tighten it up some more. As you can see, it's loose. Just like the other ones I've seen, like the, the main ones. A lot of people were saying, unless you tighten it up with that screwdriver, it won't be all the way on there. So let me go ahead and hit it with the screwdriver. Hey, that thing fire, dog. That thing fire, man. Oh, bro, look at it. It looks so, so good. And now it's not going nowhere because I went ahead and tightened it up. And you can see I scratched it a little bit too. I don't know if the real one is like that, but, the, but this one here don't take too well to the screwdriver. It definitely scratched it up, as you can see, but... Yeah, man, this is my new. Let me see. Ooh, ooh. Okay, bro. I ain't gonna lie. She looks good. I forgot to go ahead and make sure we clear, y'all. None in the mag at all, as you guys can see. And none up top, man. You know what I'm saying? Make sure we clear. I should have started the video off by doing that. I apologize, man. But yeah, now she's. She's ready, man. She's ready. Now, I want to say shout out to G Tactical Jody, man. Um, I seen him buy a, a fake stream light as well off of um, eBay. So I was going to buy it because when he bought it, honestly, me and Bro had the exact same thoughts. Everything that he said as to why he bought a fake one, um, I felt the same way because this is about to be my... Well, I'm going to get into this, but I just want to go ahead and shout him out. And when he got it, he said it was plastic and... All of these things, but it looked good, and he said it fit the holsters that was for the, the um, TLR one. I don't know why I keep saying TLR, TLR one. So I decided to go ahead and get mine off of eBay for like fifty dollars because I wanted to get the more expensive one because everybody who bought the thirty dollar one said it felt like plastic. So eBay ended up telling me that they couldn't send it to me. Um, one of the people said they couldn't send it to me because of something going on. I put the screenshot right here, so I couldn't get it from them. So I decided to go on Timu, man. I don't know why I never bought anything from Timu. And I seen that they had one. And I seen that it was about $50, which that's what I was looking for. I was looking to spend at least $50 because I wanted it to be that good material. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know the more you spend, the more, you know, the better quality. That's how it should be for, for the most part. So I went ahead and did that. And it came in a week, man. I ordered it last Friday. Today is the next Friday. So... It came pretty fast, man. The quality feels amazing. Um, it looks just like a, TL, a TLR one. Um, like I said, the only difference from what I've seen with the fake ones is that it says streamlight.com instead of just a regular streamlight. But you can take a permanent marker or something right over that if you really wanted to, like, pass for a real one. I wouldn't do it because I really don't care that much. Plus, let me get into the reasons why I bought a, a knockoff, actually. Pretty soon, I'm going to announce it on my channel. I'm starting a shooting competition series. Also, I'm going to be just going to random shooting competitions. And I really wanted to build out. And I really wanted to build out my Glock 19. Y'all know I had built this out to be my um, EDC. So I had the, as you can see, I have the little smaller magwell on to help with that reload. But it's a really, really small magwell. Um, now I'm building this gun to be a competition gun and honestly I'm on a budget like I can't afford to spend $150 on this $100 on the Glock performance trigger $400 on the Radiant Ramjet and Afterburner so any place that I can knock off also I gotta get an um, auto waistband holster a good one so any place that I can knock off a little bit of money without taking too much of a hit because I was gonna buy just a um, 
I don't know if I want to. Would that be disrespectful? Well, I'm not gonna put it up. I was gonna put it up, but I was gonna buy a light off of Amazon that was like the exact same footprint as this, and it was a little heavier because I really want that heaviness on it. And this definitely has the heaviness to it that I was looking for. So I'm very, very happy with my purchase. Um, yeah. So I ended up not buying that gun. I mean, not buying that light. So I bought this one, and I'm happy with it so far. Definitely. Like I said, I can't aff I can't speak for everybody. I can't afford to drop four hundred dollars on the afterburner and uh, radio ramjet and afterburner. I can't afford that. I can't afford to just drop a hundred dollars or eighty dollars on a Glock performance trigger. The mag what I want is a hundred dollars, and the real TLR one is like a hundred and fifty dollars. That's like that's almost seven hundred and fifty dollars. So anywhere I can cheap out, and that's not even including the holster. My auto waistband competition hosting. I got a cheap out somewhere. I'm actually, instead of buying the, the Radiant Ramjet and Afterburner, I'm thinking about just buying the 30 barrel and buying that Harrington Arms um, compensator. Because a lot of people say that worked well as, as, as well. Okay, y'all, so I'm in my bathroom. I can't really go outside and uh, have a gun and stuff like how I want to right now because of where I'm at. I think that would probably draw a lot of attention if people just see this big, big, you know, bright light. But this is my. PL Valkyrie Mini. Try not to get all my hair products and stuff in here. Pointing it at the door, as you can see, it lights up the whole room. Um, and this is about, I think, 600 lumens. I'm gonna put it on the screen. This is that. And this is the, the quote unquote screen light. So as you can see, it definitely is brighter. You know what I'm saying? This is a strobe, strobe go crazy, I ain't gonna lie. It's definitely brighter. But if that's 600, this is about eight. I don't see this being a thousand lumens, being truthful with y'all, but I definitely think it's worth the money. You know what I'm saying? I definitely don't see this being a thousand lumens though. Let's do it one more time. That's the Streamlight. This is the PL Mini Valkyrie. This has a better quality light though. As you can see like the throw and the, um, I think it's called Candela, like that wideness. You know what I'm saying? So you can definitely tell the difference because that real Streamlight the light quality on that is so good. That's the, the Valkyrie. And once again, this is the... Yeah, yeah, this is definitely brighter, in my opinion. I could be wrong. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. This can be brighter, in my opinion. I think it is. But it's not a thousand lumens. It's definitely not. But let me get back to my setup, fellas. Yeah, as you guys saw, man, that's that on that. Um, Y'all get a good bit of look at the light. I can't stop looking at this, though, bro. Like I said, y'all bear with me. By the time I come back, I'm gonna figure out what's going on with my camera. But this is the Team Woo Streamlight, man. You know what I'm saying? And once again, shout out to that boy G Tactical Jody, man. He definitely inspired this video. He definitely inspired me with buying this when I seen how his came. Yeah, man. This is this is good, bro. Yeah, that's all the reasons why I got me a knockoff, quote unquote. But it's it's really good, bro. Now, I might take y'all with me tomorrow. It's going to be a whole nother video part. I'm about to start vlogging. I might take y'all with me to go find a holster for this at my gun dealer. Look at that. Look at how good that looks, man. Look how good that looks. Definitely ready and ramjet and afterburn on it. I'm not trying to spoil, the, spoil my next few videos, but definitely going to be building this out until a competition pistol man i am so excited man i'm gonna be truthful other than anything i bought for my wife this is the best 50 dollars i ever spent because if you've shot guns before and a lot of guns you know what lights are going to stay on you know lights are going to come off this light is not coming off but we don't want this to be too long man let's go ahead and get out of here in prayer short prayer short prayer dear heavenly father our father in heaven Father God, we come to you tonight to say thank you, Father God. Thank you for count for countless amounts of blessings. Thank you for always blessing us, God, even though we don't deserve it, God. You give us breath. You give us our eyesight, our smell, our hearing, our taste every single day, God. And there's some people who wake up and have none of that. They have none of it, God. And some days we take it for granted. So we want to say sorry for taking those days for granted. And thank you for allowing us to walk in the new God. We're grateful for you, Father God. Bless everybody on the other side of the screen, God. Bless them and have them have life and have it more abundantly, God. In the name of Jesus, we love you so much, Father. We ask you to continue to cover us, cover our minds. Give us a sound mind, God, as we need you and we know we can do nothing without you. Everything with you, God, is possible. Without you, we can merely do nothing, God. And we stand on that 100%, Father. We love you so much, God. We thank you and we're grateful for you, Father God. In Jesus' name we pray and all who love that beautiful name say amen. But yeah, this is this is a beauty, man. 
This is my baby, man. But I love y'all boys, man. Y'all stay tuned. More bangers on the way. I love y'all, and I'm out, bro.